I think I'm more stupid questions. Today is the 15th on the 16th. And it is my Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Friday. Today's Friday. Friday. Just Sixth Friday. day here at the emergency room. I mean, in the hospital. Emergency room. Who oh, killed somebody? Wait, I can't hear you. <laughs> what? You tell me I you hate me again with my <laughs> things? <laughs> no, I said, I said six days, and I said in the emergency room. I said I would kill somebody if I was They keep you long there. I'm telling you, people can't wait to get here. And then they get ungrateful like you in a couple of days. Ungrateful. Be a little bit better. We give you all our Pepsi and iced tea, and then they want to go home. Um, <laughs> I hate blood pressures. They hurt. You hate pain. They hurt, hurt, hurt. I do hate pain. That's because I'm in it so often. Oh, oh that's fluid. Hold on. 118. <laughs> Over 80. You're good. Oh, that fluid. You think the blood pressure would be worse? And it's not, thank God. Uh, yeah, you have a, you need Lasix or something. And they gave you some during the day. They'll give you more tomorrow. You'll be a P&O. And I'm assuming once they stop these fluids. Yeah, my nurse. What's your name? Carla. Carla. I don't even know her name. She gives me drugs. Hi, Carla. Mal Antonio. Irish. There she goes. Hey, where are you hiding? <laughs> there she is. Hi. Wait, wait. Okay, hi. Okay. That's my nurse. Nurses go too quick. They're crazy. Yes, mm -hmm. Sitting, blogging about. Well, actually, I was asked today to start blogging about sickle cell, and because there's not much, a lot of it around the line. You can't Google it. There's not like there's there's like barely people know about it. Sickle cell is not a new disease. I know, and that's what. Oops. Oh, did they give you anything here from this place? No, that's for oh. something else. There's a micrometeor or something like that they have attached to the out there. I'll see what information. It's all about every disease. You already know about sickle cell. I love oh, it every day. Yeah, I know who you. <laughs> Maybe they have something new on it that you don't. Yeah. I'm not surprised they don't have support groups even. Yeah, there's none around here. And maybe we can speak too. There's none here in Redding. So, um, people from my old hospital, St. Christopher's, told me to call, um, start a support group. Well, you a group. You've started those up, they're saying? Yeah, uh, um, online blogging about sickle cell. See, because there's many people that's on YouTube that wants to learn more sure. about it. So painful. Painful. Pain. Terrible. Pain involved with it. It kills me sometimes. But I'm still here. And I'm stronger because of it. I see the Lord doesn't give you any more than you can handle. Yes, he hard, no, doesn't. Hard to believe, though, some days, ain't it? Pushes you to your limits sometimes. All the time. But you don't know who's stronger by it. So, rate. you've never took it. Oh, when I fall, I don't have to. Oh, you yeah. Make sure you're this has been on me for, like, okay, every day since I've been here. Mind it's mind. a wireless... We call them heart monitor. We call them telemetry. Telemetry. It's a heart monitor. It's a wireless one. So, like, sometimes I drop it like a million times so far. <laughs> really. You did. And, um, like, sometimes if you drop it, the battery dies on you. So there's, like, where's the room at? Where they monitor? Third floor somewhere. They mo they have one person monitors 40 of those. Yeah, rooms they monitor. There's a whole big room. So I'm I'm pressing the button to tell the nurse that it's broke. So the lady comes in. Uh-huh. And she's like, well, what's the matter with your monitor? I'm like, the battery's dead. She's like, well, we thought you killed me. You knocked out on us. <laughs> I'm like, no, I'm still free. <laughs> I'm still here. <coughs> mm, nice. <laughs> Still here trying to get the nurse, and she's already up here bringing me a new battery. So, one more. Oh, I just got some wheezes here and there. Yeah, um, you know if they're going to do the breathing. Uh, if, if you have them, at, let me look and see if you do. Yeah, yeah, I have asthma on top of that. So, so 
This time in, I'm in the hospital for my mono, manoma. Your what? Manoma? My manoma. My, um, what is it called again? I don't know. Pneumonia. 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 I'm thinking, what the heck? I'm here for pneumonia. pneumonia. I had a crisis last week. I told you. All right. I, didn't, I don't think that's yeah, good. You're supposed to be at 115 hours. No, they turned it down. Okay. Because of my light. So, uh, it, I'll show y'all later. Now, Judge, can see time? All right. I have to see five other people, so we'll leave it at ten an hour until yes. I get time. Um, the other day I made an account. I don't know if anybody saw it, but they had me at what was it, two hundred and fifty? Mm, I know you're at one hundred and fifty is what I got ordered. And I mean, you feel terrible. Yes, I um, do. It's it, so strong. You can see it. Mm -hmm. This is gonna be hard because my camera is like broke. But <sighs> let's do it right here. Can you see it? You wanna hold do these this? People are actually listening to you. They are. No, not right now. I didn't no. upload. Them. But am I doing? I can't. I don't know. Okay. There you go. But That's a good leg, one. Yeah, it is so swollen. There's no ankle. Yeah, my leg is swollen. Top to bottom, all the way up. I'm not gonna keep going up because there's perverts probably watching this too. <laughs> so. Okay, I'm gonna go out in the world. All right. You have other patients. <laughs> Call you if I need you. Okay, please do. But um. And actually check on that IV. All right. But that was that's my nurse. Carla, but um, like I was saying, I was to ask to put out a daily blog. Can you close it? Thank you. I was asked to put out a daily blog for the people out there that have sickle cell that don't have a voice. I have a voice. Many of y'all heard, and I'll be doing this from time to time. It won't be daily, everyday thing. The hospital puts out a monthly newsletter so on the newsletter they'll put out where you can come talk to me if I have any questions or anything y'all um, send me an email or anything we can talk about different things it doesn't always have to be sickle cell but like I was saying right now I'm in a hospital for my pneumonia you know, I'm still getting over my sickle cell crisis and um, asthma, and I'm still wheezing, as you heard her say earlier, from from the pneumonia. It's taking a lot out of me, and my leg this time it exploded so much. I was in so much pain the other day. It I, it was hard. So I wanted I wanted to thank a couple of people. Cause I called, I put the number on of my hospital room on here, and a couple people had called me, and I wanted to thank y'all for calling me, Victoria o Osha from Connecticut, and Dolores from Scatter, and sickle cell, sickle cell anemia association down in Connecticut. Y'all both called me, and I I really appreciated that. Because I don't really have a lot of people around me that has sickle cell. I, I don't practically know anyone who has sickle cell besides me. So, this is my starting out blog. If y'all have any questions for me, concerns, I, I don't know how long I'm going to still be in this hospital room. But the hospital number for my room is 610-988. 9258 and y'all can call me because I have nothing better to do anyways and after I get out of the hospital y'all can always email me and I check my site every day because I just got a new laptop so like I said thank you for listening I hope you enjoy and you have a good night and a good year um Bye.